love you all. Bye bye. Many, many greetings to all viewers. How you doing? I hope you're well, every single one of you. Today is another beautiful day in Silet. Look at it. Wow, amazing. It's been raining like never, like cats and dogs. As you know, it is the monsoon season, so it is going to be raining literally every single day. Anyway, I'm off to Millennium Market to visit one of my uncles. He has a shop in Millennium Market in Zinda Bazaar. So let's go and see his shop and let's see what he has. So follow, enjoy, relax. It's all about to go down. And if you didn't know, guys, you got it. Now you know. Are you Viewers, one of the reasons that uh, I'm visiting my uncle today in Millennium Mall, shopping mall, is because um, I'm thinking of starting my own merchandise. A for Helping Hands Network, B for Ash Vlogs. So I'm going to speak to him, I'm going to design it. I've actually got someone to design my logos, a cousin brother of mine from Birmingham. Uh, Rakib, big up to you for designing all my logos and doing all my artwork and i've come to my uncle today so he's gonna saw all the material all the price and all the design and hopefully my merchandise should be ready maybe just after eid and i'm thinking of um, producing all the fabrics material in bangladesh and then exporting it to uk and selling it in uk and it's something i've been thinking for a very long time I did make some uh, garments in UK a few years ago. You might have seen on a lot of videos of mine, but uh, I found it very hard to sell and break even because it cost me so much money to make it and I didn't make no profit. So I ended up just giving to all my friends and families just to wear. But anyway, let's go and uh, see my uncle and see what kind of deal we could sort. And um, you know what? A lot of times it's good to do business in the family and keep it in the family but everything will be made in Dhaka because Dhaka has got some huge big industries of garment and you'll be surprised the majority of the clothes are from uh, Bangladesh they're made in Bangladesh so many different companies like Primark Levi's uh, next most of the clothes are produced in Bangladesh and Bangladesh has a huge garment industry Viewers, so I'm at my uncle's shop, but the funny thing is, um, 
my uncle wasn't here. I think he went out to pray namaz. And as soon as I came to the third floor, I was asking everybody where is Shuhab's uh, shop. And I gave his address, Bori Hamdi. They go, oh, we don't know who he is. But you know why? Because they actually want you to go to their shop and do shopping. Even they know who he is, they won't tell you. And that's what they do in Bangladesh. I don't know why they do it. Anyway, I had to phone him, but he's told me exactly the name and the location, so I found him. But I find it quite bizarre when you come to Bangladesh, a lot of times they try to just force you into certain shops and make you buy everything. And when you don't buy stuff, they get really upset and they get angry. So they don't like people doing uh, window shopping and uh, they don't like to tell you a lot of stuff. But anyway, I'm here at my mama shop. So let me show you my small soul mama shop. Please visit this shop. He will look after you. He's on his way. And let me show you a tour of Millennium Market. Thank you very much again for your love and support. Please keep me in your prayers, in your dua, and um, I shall see you in the next video. Please subscribe, like, comment and share all my videos if you do enjoy it with your friends and families and uh, give it a thumbs up.